Greetings, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mangs, and I welcome you to part 31 of Let's Play Fire Emblem 7. We're currently taking on one of the hardest chapters in the game. Next turn, Hector should be able to go and shop. However, there's like a bazillion Valkyries incoming. Zarek only has so many Divine Tomes. However, I can rescue Will. The question is, do I want to? Um, I guess he is soaking up a lot of the hits, and Rebecca will give him some dodge. Mm. I suppose I'm just gonna heal him up. I'm glad I can still heal Berserk units. Alright, one thing's for sure though, we need to kill this chick. Is that a, that's a Valkyrie, so she needs to go down. I don't like leaving that bishop, though. I might just take that bishop out instead. Hmm. Yeah, if I leave that, if I if I leave my choke, the, the the bishop could come killing my guys, and I don't want that. All right, should be good. Yeah, we'll, we'll trust Will survives a while longer. Uh, Rebecca, if I remember correctly, has wind affinity, so she gives a lot of dodge. Hit points and resistance. Oh, as good as leveling resistance. So he has an avoidance of 60. These guys have... oh, crap. Now Rebecca is actually fire affinity, so she only gives offensive bonuses to him, I think. I can't rescue him, because if I do, well, you know what's gonna happen. Alright, light brand time. I think Lin should go over to Will, to be quite honest. Because Lin also gives Will some bonuses. Alright, let's see if she can take out this guy. If she get a critical, she should be able to. Her crit chance is not bad. However, it's not good enough either. See, how is Sarah's uh, resistance? Pretty darn good. Magic is pretty darn good too. What happens if Merlinus gets berserked? <laughs> oh god damn it, this game. This game. Oh crap. Can Jafar wake up now, please? I need hand axes. I need hand axes, javelins, and short spears and tomes. Oh, God damn it, Will. You better survive. Looks like he's doing good. Harkin is still sleeping. Once Jafar wakes up. I think I'm gonna send him to kill... Actually, I could recruit Vida with Hector. That would actually be pretty sweet. I'd get some more lances out of that. Maybe even some swords. I don't know. Oh, that's good. Actually, the light brand is terrible. Why can't it crit? Why does it have 0% chance to crit? Can the light brand not crit? That's kind of garbage. Why is that? So with any luck, Sarah should be able to hold the Valkyrie reinforcements in place. They're probably just gonna run past her though as soon as they see someone else to attack. Dun, dun, da, da, dun. This is why I don't like the light brand. Look how crappy it is. At least I'll be able to retaliate, which is good, but it's still a bad sword. I don't understand why it can't crit. That makes no sense. Okay, Will is doing very good. Support helps him out a lot. Dun, 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 dun. Oh crap. Don't hit, don't hit, don't hit. Good. Harkon, you need to wake up now. We need you. Okay, that's fine. Using up the enemy's purge tomes, always a good thing. However, the problem with Linus right now is that I can't. Huh? Oh, a longbow. Okay. 
I can't steal his uh, iron rune, which means he'll be an absolute nightmare to deal with. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no! No! Oh! Holy crap, Will. Look at, look at her chance to hit them. Well, they are in forts, but still. Oh my god. Four damage, Sarah? Really? Well, at least she's keeping them occupied. That's good. And they're blocking their own forts, which is actually a very good thing. Less reinforcements for us to deal with. And Sarah is actually getting decent experience from this. If she, she could only level up her magic a little bit more. Chink! These Valkyries are fucking insane. They double Sarah, guys. They fucking double Sarah. I don't want them anywhere near my guys. Oh crap, what's this? A oh, come on! No, no more, please. Oh, please. God damn it, no more sleep staves. Please, I beg. No, 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 no! No! No more! Please! Please, I need. No! No, no more. Okay, so I can pretty much ignore Lynn. Okay, first things first, I need to get uh, Marlinas the fuck away from here. I have to heal Will. Okay, first things first, let's do some shopping. Let's sell, let's see what. Oh my god, yes. Yes. No hand axes? Are you kidding me? They're selling no hand axes here, guys. However, luckily. Oh god damn it. Yes. Yes. Shine tomes. Yes. Hellfire tomes. Fuck yes. Thunder tomes. Yes. Yes. Oh god damn it. God, that felt good. Shopping spree! Alright, so I could go and grab a tome with Pant now if I want. Okay, do I. If I don't heal Will, he will die. I can guarantee it. However, I'm not sure which one uh, Lin is actually going to attack. Okay, how for how long is Jafar sleeping? One more turn. Rebecca. Oh crap, I should have bought bows. Alright, well, she's... Nah, I have to keep her around here. I might as well bring Merlinus up instead. That might be better. Alright, uh... Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna have to keep keeping them busy then. Maybe I'll use up her Thunder Tomes so she can't attack anymore. Har har. Yeah, this is bad. I'm not sure, even sure how I'm gonna defeat this chapter right here. Alright, let's kill this guy. At least Marcus is holding strong. And how are we gonna deal with it when Vida shows up with all of her fucking Wyverns? Okay, well, that's good. I'm just gonna have to deal with her being berserk. I have two berserk units right now, and I have no means to restore them. And the Valkyries are healing up. Just what I not needed. Oh, come on! They're going for Melinas, aren't they? I think I'm gonna have to rescue Will as soon as he stops being berserked. Go down to the cart, rescue him, bring Rebecca with him. No, 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 no. Not Lynn. Dodge, 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 dodge. Dodge, dodge. You need to dodge, dodge. Okay. God damn it, this chapter is insane. <laughs> How am I gonna do this? I don't know how I'm gonna do this, guys. I really don't. As soon as those Valkyries start attacking Harkin and Guy, I think I am royally fucked. Lin is berserked. 
Oh. Dampa. Hmm. Alright. It's a wonder that Will has survived so long. I don't quite get it, I must say. Lynn needs to dodge. It's not something she's really good at with the steel sword in hand. But Will is doing a spectacular job. The so question is for how long can I leave Lynn berserked? Okay, good job, Harkin. I really need these guys to wake up now. Seriously, I need these guys to wake up now. No, good. I also need to heal then. Yeah, go ahead, purge me. Okay. Oh, crap. Ah, longbow snipers. <laughs> Fucking wyverns. I need. Well, at least now I have pants. He should... Oh, fuck. That's Vida. No, 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 no. No! No! Dodge! The far, no. And so it ends. Crap. Yeah, I think my, my take on this chapter... Uh, I think I need to revisit my strategy, actually. I think what I need to do is I need to bring a flying units because yeah now you can see now things are really starting to get bad because now the Valkyries have shown up and see how much damage they do to Guy they will kill him they will kill him you can bet on it they will like he's being lucky now but there's like two or three hits and he's dead yeah, I, I can't afford to advance on these guys. What I... Oh, yeah. Uh, now you guys can see the problem here. Hector can't buy any more stuff now. This is an insane map. Absolutely insane. Yeah, there you can see. Two more hits like that. Guy's a goner. So, yes. Uh, and all of these reinforcements. Crap. Alright, so yeah, I'm, I'm royally fucked right now. I don't think there's a different word for it. So what I need to do, I think, is I need to... I need to probably hold a defensive position on, this, on these ports right here. Now, the bad thing here is that I can't get hand axes, which are the units I really... Which are the things I really need. However, I can buy tomes for Pent and Sarah. So I probably, and as well as bows for, for Will, and, uh, Will and Rebecca. I can't get any more restore staffs, but I guess I'll have to make do with those I got. Yeah, I, I am royally fucked. There's nothing I can do about this situation. At all. Holy crap, she's really powerful. Alright, I'll see you in the next chapter, ladies and gentlemen. Goodbye. Alright, we're not going to have a 30 minute episode, so I'm actually going to continue for a little while. Thir that's way too short. So anyway, I replayed the chapter, and I formulated a different strategy to take on this map. So I decided to, to bunker down on this little island right here, and use the three bridges as choke points. I sent uh, Florina up to the shops to buy some much needed equipment, so now everyone in the army should be properly equipped. Although I don't have any hand axes, which is a big shame. I've sent her up to the village, I'm gonna go visit it, and I'm gonna pray she manages to stay alive. I don't think there's many long-range, um, long-range people here, so... But even if even if she does die, I stocked her up with heal staffs just so I could send the items to Merlinas. I have enough heal staffs, so that shouldn't be any problem. But even if she dies, it's not gonna be a huge issue. So I know I, I had to use her, or else I wouldn't be able to do make do this chapter. So the archers are pretty goddamn decent right here, because they do get attacked over the river here. Uh, which means that they can pretty much retaliate on everything, which makes them really good. Anyway, uh, I do want to... I do want to have Sarah tank this, uh, tank this bridge here. There's a lot of magic users, so she definitely could, could handle it. The only problem is the Nosferatu mages. Also, I probably need to 
give her some lightning tomes soon, because the aura, the divine is a little bit heavy. All right, let's hope she can actually take down this guy. Yes, she can. Very good. Ding, 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 ding. Hit points, and well, she capped out resistance at least. And what's amazing about Will right here is that he can, he really shines there because he stands next to Rebecca, but at the same time they get to shoot down a whole bunch of enemies. Luck. Alright, well that's a pretty crappy level up, mister. Alright, I'm just gonna go and... I guess Marcus could... Actually, I'd, I'd rather want... I, I think I'd rather want to have Marcus next to Harkin. Now, which one of them are best equipped to deal with these guys? Well, Marcus has the most resistance. Oh, Harkin, I can actually move across rivers? Can Druids do that? Hmm. Interesting. Alright. I think Marcus should be able to handle this, especially next to Harkin. Also, Lynn also has an Iron Bow, which makes her... A lot more useful. I actually think I want to train her bow skill. There we go. I also want to have her next to Will, actually. I should have killed that guy with Guy instead. Alright, Rebecca's gonna stand here and take hits from the different units. Hector is just gonna stay in the background. Alright, let's go visit the village before it gets destroyed. Ah, you. Huh? Go. I saw nothing. I met with no one. Wait. Take the staff. Thank you for Prince Cephiel. Warp! Alright, awesome. Now let's send Florine up into the mountains and hope she stays alive. Alright, he's coming after her. He's like, you stole my village, bitch. So, due to the sheer number of enemies, most of these enemies will actually be forced to attack Marcus in melee, which is kind of what I really wanted to happen. Because now they've already flooded all the different areas in which he can be attacked, except the rivers. That means the other Dark Mages will probably be forced to attack him in melee, which would be very good for me. Oh, Pants. Alright. <laughs> Idiots. Pant is stocked up with new tomes right now. Bum bum! Boom boom! Alright! This is what I'm talking about. Actually, they're going for Will now. Actually, Will could have needed a barrier staff. Now that I think about it. Not only could he need a barrier staff, but I should have Lin next to him because they have a support. And Lin support gives avoidance and crits, since she has the wind affinity. This is actually a little bit nasty right there. I don't like this. However, I don't think the silver bow, silver bow slows Will down, so that's good. Dun, dun. I also did not bring Jafar. I had to leave up a unit since uh, since I couldn't bring, uh, or since I wanted to bring. I had to bring Florina. It was either that or stop the let's play because this map would have been impossible without her. All right, this is nasty. Ah, oh, thank god. The snipers really excel in these situations right here. You can pitch them behind an enemy units. Uh. Dodge! Good! Ah, oh, yeah! So with this strategy, it's going significantly better for me. It's amazing how quickly the game can change when you just s switch up your tactic a little bit. Oh crap. Oh well, it was nice while it lasted, Florina. You did your job though. You got us the warp stuff, as well as the other equipment. You did good. You should be proud. Oh, this is not good actually. Come on, Will, you need to crit this. Because you're gonna get. Oh, never mind, he just one shots the Valkyrie. Alright. <laughs> Awesome. But yeah, I should definitely barrier up well. Alright, uh, we're still within Marcus's line of sight, so that's good. Let's barrier up the poor guy. Well. 
so that should help him out a little bit. Right, let's get Lin over here. Could actually just start killing them a little bit. I don't even think I need to use the Silver Bow, truth be told. The Iron Bow works. Glad I bought a lot of them. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Let me see, this Dark Mage can actually attack all the way over here. That's okay though. I'm fairly certain Rebecca is able to handle that. There we go, I'm probably gonna physics Will up now. Let's see, yay, we have... Okay, I guess we're gonna have to use the Brave Lance then. It's clearly the best weapon. I just gave him a silver weapon of each kind. The Silver Axe is pretty darn badass though. And not really that heavy either, if I remember correctly. 14, 12. Yeah, it's actually very light. That's what I like about silver weapons. Alright, let's get Will up. And then we're just gonna wait for the enemy to come to us, like always. Ba, 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 perfect. Of course, always criticaling on the second attack. That's the best attack to crit on. In fact, in uh, Fire Emblem 5, it's the attack you usually always crit on because of how the game works with the PPC. Just a weird system. I wonder what they thought about when they made that. Alright, Rebecca. I think she could get a crit here. She should be able to. Come on, Rebecca. There you go. Dun dun da 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 da. Let's see... Yeah, strength! Alright. I don't mind that, actually. Dun, da, da, dun, da. Bum, bum, bum. Alright, let's get back into defensive position again. Let's send Marcus back. Let's send... Uh, let's see... We could actually have Will here. He's actually pretty safe there. Then we could have Lin right here. Yeah, that works, actually. Let's just... Let's see, Will has six resistance. Let's barrier up Rebecca as well. Do you get more defense for standing in the river? Nah, it doesn't give any avoidance. At all. Alright, we should probably heal up Marcus. I don't want to move Sarah though, that's why I'm using this physics staff. It's a little bit stupid, but... There we go. Alright, let them come. That's all I can say. Attack Marcus. If only he had a javelin. Imagine how awesome he'd been. But it's okay. I could, of course, just put Hark in there with a light brand, but he wouldn't really be able to do a whole lot. Also, I should probably send a welcome party to deal with Vida and her Vyverns. I don't think Harkin can do it on his own, though. He might be able to, if I can find a suitable forest to place him in. And a good axe. Dun, dun. Wow, he's actually attacking Marcus. Interesting. I guess I can understand that. But then again, he's gonna die all the same, so... <laughs> oh, yeah! Orphan Maker strikes again. Da, 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 da. Hit points, strength, speed, resistance. Wow, that's a really good level up. Holy crap. Alright, still nothing. I think if I can place Harkin in one of these woods right here, give him a good axe, I think that could work. Let's give him a really good axe, not a crappy one. Let's give him a. Oh, we can't use silver axes yet. Alright. 
Let's just give him some iron axes then. Do give him the brave sword too. He actually... Oh, he needs to level up his sword skill as well. Interesting. Alright, let's send Harkin to deal with Vida and her reinforcements. That works, actually. Wow, we are really demolishing their reinforcements right now. See, does the Brave Land slow Marcus down? I think it does. Yeah, definitely. Let's use the Silver Sword instead. More avoidance that way. There we go. Wow. I don't know if I said this before, but Flux is actually the name of a sort of a pill that children take to get better teeth. It's like fluor, if, I don't know if that's the word for it, but I laugh every time I see it because I, it was actually quite tasty. They, they had like banana tastes, like to trick little children into taking them, because they were good for your teeth. Alright, magic, speed, defense. Pretty solid, actually. Alright. Come at us, bros. Come at us. You want to? I could actually give Marcus the light brand. Maybe that would be a good idea, actually. Yeah. I'll take that. Does he have it equipped? Yes, he does. Good. All right, Harkin, go and greet the Vyverns. Let's see. I think we're good here, actually. Yeah, we are. They're gonna go for Marcus. Ouch! Okay, that's bad. I didn't. I wasn't aware he actually didn't have healing. All right, he should be able to survive as long as, there, as long as there's no Luna Druids. I don't think there's any Luna Druids, are there? There are probably some. And again, I don't understand why the Light Brand cannot quit in ranged combat. It doesn't make any sense. Gotta say, I love the way paladins fight with the light brands. It's actually pretty badass. So they they are really afraid of attacking Will and uh, Will and uh, Luis. Now Luis, I'm saying <laughs> Will and Rebecca. I guess I can kind of understand that. However, I think I want to give Sarah Shine Tome because the divine is extremely heavy. Come on. Da, da, da. What I like about having my snipers in the river is that they can't get attacked because the river moves like in a... Uh, because of how the river is positioned. But at the same time they can attack the other guys, which is really cool. Yeah, I think I'll definitely give her a Shine Tome. I do enjoy the attack power of the Divine Tome, it's really good. But Shine has more crits, to my knowledge, and it also weighs less. Although she, did, she really doesn't have any problems with speed at the moment, but still. She will have once the Valkyries arrive. Uh, okay, we're good. Ouch. Dun, dun. I think it's time for an elixir. Either that I could just heal him up, I think that's actually better. Wow. I'm really cleaning house here. 39% critical. That's really solid, Will. Pew! Now, do I have a um, guy next to... No, wait, does Guy even have a support with Lin? No. Hector has. Should probably get Hector next to Lin, then. Alright, let's heal up Marcus. And just wait for the... They might actually not come towards us until we... If I remember correctly, the reinforcements charge once Vida appear. That's when things get really difficult. Alright. Harkin should be in position to deal with Vida. Uh, the only problem is, I think Vida has a spear. So she's probably gonna attack him from a distance. However, when he's in the forest, he should be really good. Alright. Let's move down. Uh, I can actually. Put, yeah, that's a good place to have her, actually, right there. So everyone's good? I think everyone's good. I'm just gonna wait for Vida to show up. 
I'm pretty sure she shows up at a specific turn and not... Or does she, actually? It could be the reinforcements actually do not show up until I move closer. Alright, well, I'll just move closer then. I think I need to, like, pull the reinforcements in order for them to actually start attacking me. I'll just use Pent for that. I could use Marcus too, naturally, because he's faster. I might do that instead. But at least I can kill off the Dark Mages. That works. As long as Marcus doesn't get sleeped or something. Alright, I'll just move up here. I think I'll use Pent, because he can retaliate. Now, oh, this map got suddenly got a lot easier. Holy crap, it's a pretty huge difference from last time. Where I got swamped. But I do feel like there's some reinforcements I haven't triggered. Uh, oh no, a Lunatome. 13 damage. Ow. Yeah, that does actually hurt a little bit. Alright, will they come at us now? Yeah, now I think I've aggroed them. Oh no. No, 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 no. I can go up and restore him, but... Ah, crap. Alright, I should probably rescue him then. Why isn't he doing anything? Do I need to move even closer? What is she doing now? Ah, eclipsing, okay. I was wondering why the Overland sprites for those Dark Majors are actually female. Yet, when shown on uh, shown in the actual animations, they are male. Because I know that Fire Emblem does have a female animation for them, so... Alright, let's wake Pent up. Okay, how if I move up here then? Will that aggro them? Oh, here comes the hero. Ah! Okay, come on, crit him, Pants. Actually, he doesn't need to. Oh, he doesn't even double him. Alright. Alright, I think that calls them to move. Da, da, da. Okay, perch home. Uh, do you actually standing in forts make you more difficult to sleep? I think it's only related to your resistance. Uh, nah. Actually, actually the, uh, the chance increases the closer they get, it would appear. Okay, that sucks. I need to wake him up then again. Or I could just go and rescue him. That works too. What's this? Oh no! Eclipse! Don't hit me! I do believe I have a rescue staff. I should be able to fetch them. Alright, here they come. This is actually a little bit nasty. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go fetch the rescue staff with pants. Sarah could should be able Okay, here they are. Here they come again, those little Lysian nobles. Okay. Yes, I'm most likely going to go and wake Pent up. Oh, that's bad. Actually, it would it probably would be easier if I just rescued him right away. See where's the rescue staff? I know I have it. There we go. Now, I don't know how far she can actually reach with that. Ah, oh, come on! Ah. Oh. All right, can I kill Vida with the brave sword? I'm nah. I can't crit her. Poison lance, really? Why on earth would you fight with a poison lance? Anyway, it's a good t it's a good chance for Harkin to level up his axe skill. In fact, if I'd given him the devil axe, he'd level up his axe skill immediately. There's a hidden use with the devil axe that many people don't know. You level up your weapon skill insanely fast with it. All right, don't kill Pent. Thank you. Okay, Pent's gonna take a lot of beating right now. Actually, this is very scary. In fact, I can actually recruit Vida. I might do that. I might lure her in, her in with the units. And then go speak to her with Hector. It'd be nice to have a flying unit that I could rescue people with. 
Alright, Pant. He's gonna take such a beating right now. I'm actually not sure if he's going to survive this. I should have went with another unit. I should have had the rescue staff on Sarah to begin with. That was pretty stupid of me. Oh no, not Molinus. It's okay. He has godlike avoidance. He's good. Oh no! Purge! At least Pant's in a fort, so his avoidance is pretty awesome. But will it be awesome enough? Hopefully. Wow. She's pretty good. Yeah, I can't talk to her with Hector, that should do it. Oh fuck you. God damn it, I hate status staves. Da 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 Worst tome in the game. Although Antonin did actually teach me that they're really good for breaking walls, and I can understand that. What do you? Oh no! Okay, that could have been really bad, actually. All right, I think I hope Pent should be good here. Oh god damn it, Pent! God damn it, Pent! Ant! There you go. I can imagine Pent just standing in the fort going like... <sighs> and then dodging every time he gets attacked. That's how badass he is. Da, da, da. Alright, he's gonna be fine. Now I can rescue him and probably send him away. No, wait, Marcus is actually sleeping, the fool. Ah! Wow! <laughs> Alright. If I move one sp step to the north, I should be able to rescue Pence. There we go. No, wait, what? There we go. That's really not where I wanted him to land. He can still be attacked from there. This this thing is very annoying. Pew! Alright, I think I'm gonna try to lure Vida over to Hector. At least that's gonna make it a little bit easier for Harkin. I was about to say I wanna remove Vida's leadership stars. I think I've been playing for too long. Alright, Vida is actually able to go for Guy right here, and I think I will do that. Let's just equip a silver sword so we don't get hits. Let's just keep massacring the... Uh, oh, they have javelins, actually. Alright. Better focus on the ones with javelins, though. They're the most annoying. At any rate, I should be able to get Harkin's axe rank up to B or to A, so I can use silver axes. Alright, I hope Pent will survive. I think he will. Okay, now they, are, they come with a little bit of different weapons, I assume. But that would actually be kind of hilarious to equip the Devil Axe on, Har on Harkin and see how quickly it levels up his skill. However, it's very dangerous. His luck is not that great. His luck is actually pretty bad. However, I'm pretty sure Vida's gonna go for Guy. And uh, that will make me able to recruit her. And I would actually, if I could give a spear to Marcus, that'd be fucking great. Oh, hello. You wanna die? We could arrange that. Goodbye! Problem is, I still need to actually wake Pent up. Same with Marcus. If I wake up Marcus, I should be able to rescue Pent and then drop him off later. I think that's exactly what I have to do. Oh, this is scary. Ah, uh, fuck. Duh, have I failed again? Most likely. I think I failed again. Mm. Okay, good. At least one of my plans is working as intended. Holy crap, she's scary. No, the Eclipse Tome will never be good. 
problem is it has ten hits. Ten hits! It has ten fucking hit, unless it's been changed, which I don't think it has. Right, I just lost something. There we go. What happened? Did she get silenced? No, she didn't get silenced. However, this is scary. Oh, crap. Oh, I think I've lost anyway. Yeah, I'm probably dead now. Fuck! Alright. Yeah. Lord Pence! I left my guard down, I'm sorry. Oh no, Lord Pence. He's sleeping. Calm yourself, Luis. But, but... This is no time for tears, is it? Unless... You plan on the two of us dying here together? Never. Thought I would never allow. You must not die, my lord. And neither should you, my wife. Lend me your shoulder, would you? Yes, of course. Where did she come from? Alright. Well, okay. I'll see you in the next part, ladies and gentlemen. This went to hell.